Antimatter is the opposite of matter. It has the same mass but opposite charge. One theory about why antimatter exists was developed by John Wheeler and Nobel laureate Richard Feynman based on the idea that physical systems are time reversible. For example, the orbits of our solar system when played backward would still obey all the same rules as when played forward. This led to the idea that antimatter is just an ordinary matter but going backward in time. That would explain why antiparticles have an opposite charge. And by that logic, if two electrons repel each other going forward in time, they attract each other going backward in time. You know, that explains why matter and antimatter annihilate. This just isn't about two particles crashing into and destroying each other. It's the same particle going in an endless loop, forward in time, then backward, then forward, and so on. Although the accuracy of this theory is still up for debate.